are patients guinea pigs if they go into clinical trials? And really the answer is a resounding no. Um, and also the thing to remember is that the safety and the rights of patients who enter clinical trials are deeply protected in, uh, in the law and, and guidelines around how trials are conducted. So safety is paramount, um, but no, patients are not guinea pigs. They are informed, uh, informed consent about the, the risks and benefits. Now, having said that, we are talking about sometimes new treatments, uh, which, uh, are, which we don't know if they're more effective than our existing treatments. That's why we do the trials. So um, when we ask patients to consider taking part in a trial, there is risk. Um, we hope though that we're designing trials to, make, to help people either to live longer or to live better. So the principle of clinical trials is not to put people at higher risk, it's to, it's to make things better for them. But you know, sometimes when there's newer treatments that we haven't got as much experience with, uh, that there is some risk, and, uh, but we would hope to be able to explain that clearly to people before they make a choice about whether to take part.